I'll be explaining uh, the, the demo we have as Khan Concept here at the, at the arm booth. And what you're seeing is uh, our two systems. Uh, one is the uh, Sophie uh, reference platform, uh, the, the AVA platform, uh, which is running the L4E hypervisor. Um, and the second system is uh, an NXP uh, S32Z with Cortex R52 uh, processors, also running our newly introduced uh, FOE micro hypervisor. This system uh, is, uh, is, is important here in this demo because it's uh, the, the first uh, processor um, of the Cortex R series uh, that allows to have a hypervisor and run virtual machines uh, on this kind of uh, processors. Um, the overall demo is, is about an, an outerware stack that we are showing here. So in, in the uh, screen over here, you see uh, the outerware stack running in a virtual machine uh, on the AVA platform. Uh, it is doing some uh, route calculation and the car is driving around, uh, all, all done by the uh, outerware software stack. And the uh, one, but one component has been taken out uh, of the software stack, uh, not running on the AVA platform, but running on the uh, S32Z. Um, and that is uh, some actuation component uh, from the outerwear stack that basically uh, tells the car uh, about steering and uh, deacceleration and acceleration. Um, and this basically showcase, showcases uh, the safety case uh, which is uh, possible on uh, those kind of uh, real-time platforms. Um, in the demo, we also have other VMs running on the uh, on the Cortex R platform. Uh, another FreeRTOS VM running there, and another Sapphire VM. Um, in the same way, we have uh, this also running uh, on the uh, on the AVA platform. They are also running, obviously, other other VMs uh, showing uh, showing the hypervisor. Um, a very nice feature of our system is uh, it's all based on the same FOE code base, uh, which basically means that. Uh, on the uh, on the Cortex A platform with the Neoverse, as well as on the Cortex R platform uh, with the R52 here, the, a the APIs to the hypervisor and our operating system framework are really uh, it's the same, allowing you to put uh, applications uh, either on, on either side. So you have the same applications using the same APIs running either on the Neoverse or on the uh, Cortex R platform as your system uh, design or system uh, architecture. Um, requires uh, uh, allowing you to, to flexibly design your system uh, as you need it.